Hope everybody's been good lately. I'm actually going to upload a video from a few years ago. This one was with my cousin Drake. It was actually the biggest muskie he had ever caught. And I have a lot of new subscribers and followers now. So I figured I would upload this and let you guys see an early trip when I was first starting to film. This was a uh, day in February that was mild for February. If I remember right, I think it was like in the 30s. So it was awesome. It was an awesome memory we made. And I wanted to share it again with you guys so you can see it. So appreciate everybody that subscribed and followed me. And hopefully there's many more adventures to come. So thanks for watching. happening I'm back I'm fishing tonight the one and only Drake Olderman uh, we're fishing for basically whatever bites but where we're at there's a variety of species um, there's striper here walleye, lake trout, musky, brown trout, smallmouth bass, so we'll see what happens. Here Drake, give them a um, synopsis oh. what's going on there. Yeah, it's always a good thing right there. So he has a four and a half inch jerk bait on. What are you tying on there? Three and a half inch brown trout. Okay. Because it gives it a darker color in the water. Yeah. And the water's clear. That might be better because there's no flash in it. Yeah. So you're, since you're using the shad, I thought we'd switch it up a little bit. Yeah, that's a good idea. A little bit of both worlds. Best of both worlds, you know what I mean? Oh, Shake and bake, baby. That's what you want. Yep. Alright, well, okay. thanks. That was a good synopsis. All right, stay tuned here. When we get one, we'll get the light on. We'll show you us catching it. Maybe a show. Better believe it. All right, there you go. Thanks. Drake has got a giant musky. Okay, fight it easy, buddy. Wear it out. Don't just let it. Don't horse it. Okay, yeah, just remember what I told you. Bring it right in that. Drake. Okay, just take your time, buddy. Right in there, right in there. Take your time to back up. Oh my gosh. Drake has got, is this the biggest one of your life? Oh, Left, bring it right over there, buddy. Bring it in there. No, no. Drake, left, 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 left. Left, you're gonna have to pull it in there, can you? Yeah. Okay. I'm going in then. Right. I'm, I bet just you. You want me to keep the light on? Yeah. Right in there. Right in there. Take your time, Drake. Take your time. Just don't horse him. Okay. 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 Keep coming. Pull in. Okay. Hold on, hold the light, hold the light, hold the light. <laughs> like, that. like a 40. <sighs> 40 plus. That's how bad I got my finger in that muskie's mouth, and that's how quick it cut me up. Drake just caught the biggest fish of his life. I don't know, I just am so worked up. I don't even know what to do. <laughs> That just happened so quickly. That escalated so fast. Well, we're here in February. And if you can see what's in that hole, I'm guessing, what do you think that is, Drake? 48 inches? Oh, yeah. We got a 48 inch walleye. Or, er, walleye. <laughs> walleye. Wow. Monsky. If it was a walleye, it would be like. <laughs> 
Yeah, it just worked out. We got a gigantic muskie. And that little guy right there, well, he's not little anymore, but that old Drake got her done. And he wants out. We were worried he might be getting hurt, but he ain't hurt. Drake, just make sure he don't go over that rock right there where my light is. That's the only place. Do you want me to go and get it? Yeah. <laughs> this is probably, if not, it probably is. I caught one up at Lake Erie. That was about the, maybe a inch or so bigger, but about the same size. I don't even know if it was bigger actually. This thing is just huge. Too bad we didn't have this net. Yeah, <laughs> how about it? Where are your pliers at? They're in that bit, yeah. Just here, you have to unstrap, yeah, yeah. Here, film for a minute. I'm gonna give like a little talk. It's black. Can you see it now? Yep. As you can see, can you see that? Yeah. This muskie, I reached in too far and it literally lit me up, but it was worth it. I was wrangling it for Drake. It, I mean, cut me, I am bleeding really bad. <laughs> but here, show that down in here. This thing is just unbelievable. It's just crazy. I just can't believe how big it is. Just awesome. This is why we fish. Right right here. I mean this this fish is probably 18 years old. Once in a lifetime. Yeah, I mean Drake's been how old are you? 16. 17. I mean, he's fished tons too since he was a little kid. And we've thrown hundreds of thousands of casts probably even here we fished so many times and then finally in february we get a warm day we come up here in the dark and he catches the fish of his life that is just awesome one moment we'll never forget <laughs> no. to look at a fish like that man i'm proud of you drake nice job my pants and stuff are all bloody <laughs> it's worth babies, it. these fish right here don't mess around though no way. The good thing is, too, though, is we got him in here. He's definitely fine. He has some battle wounds, but he's definitely fine. We're going to get this Rapala out of him and then get some pictures and let him swim away to fight again another day. Wow. Unreal. Yep. You get that, put that camera so you can see kind of like the side of them. See, so yeah, like that. Can't mess them too much. He'll I know, he'll turn freak. right back. It's just nice feeling a fish like this. I just can't believe that, man. All the scrapes from all the mirrors you've been in here. Yeah. It's hard to believe, like a fish, if you think that fish is older than you, probably. Yep. Fighting. A fish. You caught a fish older than you. <laughs> Not saying it is, but it could be. I think, I mean, they can get definitely over 20 years old. And that fish is big enough to have been in here that long. Oh, yeah. Unbelievable. Shine that light.
And then my whole hand comes out like my finger. <laughs> yeah. It help, you know, it helps with this cold water. Yeah, just pull it out that way real slow. Yeah, yeah. Get, get on maybe that back end of it. Put your boots down in, yeah, you know what I mean, and just slowly pull it out. You might, and it might not even freak out that much. Yeah, that's what I'm hoping. Just make sure if it does, you put it back in the hole. Yeah. <laughs> and not like over the side. I mean, you know, I'll go after him, but I can't guarantee it. He's pretty big. Yeah, he's hard to hold on to. Yeah. He, he, can, he can't get out. No. I mean, he could if he really tried. Yeah, right there. Yep. Here, look. Wow. Absolute beast. What do you have to say there, Drake? <laughs> well, it was a crazy experience. Yeah, it was. Biggest one of his life. Took us by surprise. Sure did. We'll have to get to get the rat paw out of there. Put him back in there. Yep. Perfect. He's in good shape too. Yeah, let him. Almost got it. I think it's broken. I see a piece of the hook in his lip down there. Yeah. Come on, buddy. Take it easy. Almost got you free. Turn that way a little closer. There it is. There we go. Okay. At least he doesn't have that lure in his mouth. Yeah. You can hold on to its tail and kind of nurse it till it it wants to go. If it wants to go, I mean, but just kind of back and forth. Yeah, he's kind of he's starting to kick a little bit. Yeah. Just keep nursing him there. If he goes, and let him go. There he goes. I'm pretty sure that's the log that we uh, saw earlier. Saw earlier. <laughs> There's a man that caught it right there. That's what we do. Oh yeah, nothing but that. Sweet. <laughs> well, it's gonna be hard to uh, beat that. Yep. <laughs> All these nights. Unbelievable. All right, everybody. You see me? Good? Yep. All right, everybody. I think that's gonna be our trip tonight. Uh, we're getting a really bad storm, like really bad winds and rain is coming. So <laughs> we're gonna call it. But as you'll see, that was the biggest muskie he's ever caught. And I never have caught one that big either. So it's gonna be hard to beat. Pretty awesome. It's February in Pennsylvania and 
we just caught up basically we're gonna measure it we measured it on his rod so we'll when we get back we'll measure it with the tape but we're guessing 48 to 50 inches so it was awesome but anyways until next time keep reeling them in <laughs>